Hey guys, what's going on? Today I'm doing a what's in my baseball bag ch um, video. So I have two bags right here. As you can see, there is a uh, just a regular fielding and tinning bag containing my bat, my helmet, my glove, etc. And then there's a catching bag in here. So I'm just going to do my regular fielding bag first and then I'm going to go into the catching bag um, after that. So first off, I just want to say this is in my bag. It's a um, Easton bag. Pretty simple. Has two bat holders. Got my logo for my team right there. My number in the inside, number 42. Pretty simple there, but um, this is the helmet that I'm going to show you first. So uh, it says the symbol of my team and the Marucci symbol. And then it's a D Marini. It's got the American flag on the back right there. And it's got the C flap. So. C flap actually helps a lot. Like I've seen kids get hit in the face, like right in the cheek before. So if you can break your jaw and end your like whole season. So next thing I'm gonna do my um, batting gloves. I have two pairs of batting gloves. One I don't really use, but one I do use. So I'll do the one that I don't use first. So these blue ones, these are like really thick. They are like these are ones that I use more for like the spring season. I live on Long Island, so it's gets pretty cold in the spring, but um, I use the cold these in the colder weather. But then for the Franklin batting gloves, these are like a lot thinner. So I use these for like the summer and like, the early fall when it's still kind of warm out. Those are my batting gloves. Now for the bats. Now for this bat, I have a um, wood bat. This is a Beaver Company. It's a blue stained with a uh, just pine tar right there and some... Uh, white grip tape so that's a pretty nice wood bat it's an ash 31 26 i believe so that means you to drop five so yeah now for my bb core bat this bat is a pretty heavy bat it's thir it's a 32 29 and i'm still 11 so that's why i need to probably get a lighter bat soon but yeah so it's just a drop three bat and yeah. Now for the accessories that I have in this bag. So I have quite a few accessories. I'll go from like I don't know, just just pull them out. So um, these are just this is like a compression sleeve that I put on my arm just to wear. It's like October. Um, this is also October stuff. This is like a um breast cancer awareness pink wristband and same with this, this is a pink um necklace now for the uh catching catching wristbands i have two all-star all-star wristbands these help with like blocking but these really just don't really help that much but these this does this evo shield catchers um wrist guard this like is I've saved my wrist a bunch of times with this thing. Like I just got it late fall, but it's still it's really helpful. I saved my wrist a bunch of times already. So like yeah. That's it for the accessories. Now I'm gonna go on to the glove and my Oakleys that I have. So first off there is a a Outlaws Beanie. This is a tournament team that I play on. We got this from our coaches. And it's a, this is like a cold. We played in this tournament. It was super cold out, so we got those. That's pretty cool. But now for the Oakley sunglasses. So I got them in this little case here. And um, they are the sky blue or the ocean blue lenses with the blue frames and the yellow um, like rubber things at the end. So these are like... These are really nice sunglasses. They really block out the sun a lot. Like, if you're playing, like, first base or something, and you're, like, yeah, the sun's right in your eyes, these are, like, really good, and you can actually track the ball still. So these are really useful, and they come in handy, especially on, like, the sunny days. And now for my glove, and this will wrap up the, um, regular fielding and, fielding and um, hitting glove bag so uh this is a wilson a2000 um it is a pro stock 1786 11 and a half inch 
And this glove is it's so nice. It has like a perfect pinky flare and then a really nice thumb flare. And it took me like a couple of weeks to break this in, I think, like fully. But now it's just it's perfect. It's like if I break it anymore it'll just not be the same, but this thing right here, it's amazing. Oops. Sorry guys, my phone dropped. I'm recording with my phone right now because it's currently at 11.36 at night and I don't want to set all that up. So, uh, yeah. So right now I'm just going to go right into my catching bag. I um, recently got this here today actually uh, because my 12th birthday is coming up in two days, the 29th, day after Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving by the way. But I just got this gear, so I'm just going to take it out and show you guys how this is really nice. So, uh, first off, I guess I'll show the helmet. I keep it in this little bag that I came with because, like, this is really nice gear and I don't want to, like, scratch it up and stuff. And, um, it's just the helmet, guys. This is the MVP. I'm pretty sure it's the MVP. Let's see if it says the model. MVP 2500-1, um, this is the All-Star System 7 catching helmet. I have this throw guard on that I recently put on, like, well, I got the gear today, but I, I went to the fields with my dad, I went to the fields with my dad, and, um, I blocked a couple, and I took, like, two to the neck, so I just put on this, this throw guard to help with blocking. Now I'll go to the chest protector. So this is my chest protector. It's a same again. It's the it's the no sig um, standard baseball. It's the All Star System Seven right here. It's pretty straightforward. Um, see, and then I want to point something out about this gear. This has the um, the flex. The, the, I think it's called like Del Delta Flex on the back. This is this is why System 7 is voted like the best catching gear in the world. This is the 12 to 16 though, so yeah, this is yeah 12 to 16, really nice. And now I'm gonna go to the um the leg guards. Now these leg guards, these are the nicest thing I think I've ever owned in baseball. These leg guards are so nice, and they're just they're so nice. So let me just, I keep them buckled, to, I'm going to keep them buckled together in my bag. So, here. So this is the inside of it. You see this green stuff. don't really know what it's for, but there's padding down in your shins and around the knee. And then there's this gel that's when you block and you drop your knees. You're not, like, destroying your kneecaps. So that's what really, it's really interesting. And instead of having, like, four buckles I think you're ha you have on normal gear. This has five buckles that goes up all the way up to like your middle of your thigh. So that's like really helpful. If you like take one off the thigh it really hurts. And um, on this black it also has the same thing on the uh, chest protector as the Delta Flex. So this like goes over your leg like it's supposed to like go over your your calf muscle and it like protects it just like keeps it on better. If I can like buckle it, I can't buckle it, but it should keep your um your catcher's legs in place. Same thing for the other one, but like the only thing that I would say about this is this part gets really dirty on turf. Like the turf, the black stuff on the turf rubs off on it. That's the only thing, but that doesn't really matter. But this gear is just phenomenal. Like it's so protective and it's probably like the best. I swear my camera keeps on dropping. So guys, that is going... Actually, that's not going to do it for the video. Um, I have the other leg guard, as you can see there. Oh my god. Okay, good. Stay. Stay camera. Okay. So, I have this um the glove in here. This is just a Rawlings... Nothing, nothing too wild. So Rawlings, um, 
Mark of a Pro Gold Glove Company. It's really good with uh, youth. Like, I'm getting, I want to get a new glove soon, but I'm sticking to this one for a while because it's pretty good broken in, but that's a look on it. Uh, I think it's 33 and a half, I'm not sure. It's a little smaller. But, um, I also have this bag that you're catching your cane with. It came with this bag right here. It um, should help with um, keeping all my gear organized in there. But um, anyway, thank you guys for watching. And uh, if you want me to like do other more videos involving baseball, you can comment down below and subscribe so I can upload more videos for you guys. So um, thank you guys for watching, and bye.